Well, do you get caught up in this? A lot of folks do. School is back in session, meaning long pickup lines after school. And it is causing problems on a major roadway. News Force Hunter Elise joins us now with more on the problems it's causing. Hunter. Yeah, the street Rollingwood Elementary affects is 63rd, and while traffic only blocks one lane, it backs up pretty far with parents waiting in line to pick up their kids after school. It's crazy, and uh, it takes at least 10 minutes, 15 minutes to get through the line. This is the typical pickup line for Rollingwood Elementary. As the line picks up with parents waiting to get kids, the line on 63rd gets longer. There is a situation that needs to be resolved, but everybody griping and complaining about it isn't fixing it. We need to come together, find a solution. These children have to be picked up. If we can somewhat, you know, get it organized out because it's, it's not organized at all. Gonzalez says he spoke with a teacher this year about the line backing up to 63rd. They said that they're not supposed to, but they do it anyways because there's not a whole lot of area to park to wait for your kids, as you can see. Some parents are working to find alternate routes rather than waiting in the long line. We walk or stay in the pickup line, but the pickup line is pretty long, and so we end up just parking along the street and then doing a walk up. So it works for us, but it is a little bit of a hassle. The staff is amazing. The teachers, they're responsible for all these small children getting to their cars safely, and that needs to be everyone's focus. And we reached out to Putnam City Schools to ask if there are plans to change the pickup line direction. They said there haven't been many problems with it, but they will look into it as needed to keep students safe this school year.